Watch what's approaching, the supreme moment. Reality striking, closer than it seems, don't it? Go ahead, it's for the taking if you want it. If not, the dream dies and you'll be forever haunted. Then confront it. What's good, everyone? Good morning. Now, I did a video on this about six days, six days ago or about a week ago covering, you know, the possibilities and what to expect with the Tanabata campaign coming up for 2019. Um, they did have the V-Jump leaks come out, a lot of activity on Twitter. I think it was like, I don't know, uh, Ronaldo and Kawhi and several other leakers with the V-Jump scans. And we did have a section for the... Uh, with strips that are part of the Tanabata campaign as well as the return of Purunga. So it is officially announced that Purunga is going to be coming back. That does equate to one, you do get some with strips out of it as well as a bunch of you know good selections like hidden potentials uh, or potential orbs or uh, Grand Kai's and Elder Kai's. Um, a lot of awakening medals, training items. You know, you have a selection like last time it was basically a selection of three options out of seven total. So it's it's a really good thing to have. Now, I don't know how many sets we'll get. It might just be one, but you know, it's 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 all good. Regardless of what how many times it is, it's a, it's a pretty good deal. Perunga is always a good deal in my books. So that is, that is officially coming out. Um, the second part is we are getting the wish strips. So it'll be wish strips number two. It is coming back. Um, You'll get up to seven free SSRs out of it, out of, I think, a list of 77 units like it was last time. Now, understand that the list of the units that are able to be selected, they are not premium units by any means. But if you think about it, it's seven free SSRs that you do get to pick uh, for essentially free. So it's it's a pretty it's a pretty good deal. Um, I do see units like... Uh, you know, Kid Boo on here, Super Saiyan 3, Vegeta, uh, Beerus, Perfect Cell, uh, let's see, Super Saiyan God, Goku, Ultimate Gohan, and Shampa. You know, that's just kind of like what they said were, you know, I don't know, like highlighted units out of the out of the list. But at the end of the day, like it's seven free SSRs. You get to pick. You can actually pick the same unit a couple of times. If you, if you want to hone in on one unit and focus on the potential levels or whatever the case is, you can certainly do that. So we are getting the wish strips back and Purunga is coming back. So that's part one. Yeah, we already pretty much already covered this stuff, um, especially yesterday. But the LR Gohan and Goten are, are coming over to JP. Um, and then the return of the LR Super Saiyan 4, Goku and Vegeta are also coming back. Now, similar to last year uh, with three-year anniversary, LR, Gogeta, and Vegeta didn't come back until the Tanabata Dokkan Fest. So it's pretty much the same thing this year as well. Uh, the thing to note is it is going to be two separate banners. So don't, you know, don't get it twisted and thinking they're all going to be one banner. Uh, one will probably be, I don't know, like uh, just just a regular Dokkan Fest with the, you know, LR Gohan and Goten and whatever relevant units that came with the banner, like the uh, physical type Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, I think it was, or whatever the official name was. Um, and then you'll actually have a Tanabata Dokkan Fest banner. The thing to note about the Tanabata Dokkan Fest banner is last year when full power super saiyan 4 goku came out it was a separate banner he he was on a separate banner himself and then a week later whatever the case was uh the dokkan fest came out uh the tanabata dokkan fest came out however he was still on it but he was with uh he was included on the feature list with a, a reduced rate the same thing will probably i don't know if it'll happen i i feel like it will like you'll ha probably have a week maybe with the uh, Dokkan Fest, including the LR Gohan and Goten, and then a week later you will have the Tanabata Dokkan Fest, where it includes the LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Vegeta, uh, but also has the um, uh, includes the uh, LR Gohan and Goten, uh, but with a lower rate than the other banner. Now, from what I remember, the featured list out of the Tanabata Donka Fest banner is, is a lot. Uh, there are a lot of units featured on it, so if you're looking to pinpoint the Gohan and Goten, you're probably better off with a higher rate on their normal banner. So that's kind of the dilemma that you'll probably be facing with that. Uh, but, you know, without a doubt, um, a lot of activity is happening, so 
you know, it's gonna be it's gonna be a good month, I think, in July. Uh, Global is finally getting the uh, four year anniversary around this time as well. So, you know, I, I think both sides will have plenty of content uh, coming up. You know, the end of June or second half of June is typically a, a dry period on both, you know, both versions of of Dilkon battles. So. Things will definitely heat up and uh, pick back up, I think, coming up. So hopefully we have a lot of things to expect and uh, a lot of good news. I mean, you'll, you'll, along with this stuff, I mean, we're, there is, you know, talks about uh, a Dragon Ball Heroes collaboration banner coming up, as well as, you know, the uh, tech uh, Broly, uh, you know, LR Broly coming out as well. That'll probably be at, like, the the end of the uh, Tanabata period um, after, you know, the... LR uh, Gohan and Goten and talking about the Dokkan Fest and all that, so it'll be toward the, the end of the period probably. Um, just just a footnote, uh, the new Vegeta unit is coming out for Legends. Uh, it is on the top left of the uh, VJUP scan. I don't play Legends myself, so just wanted to uh, briefly touch on that. But as of right now, based on the VJUP scans, that's pretty much all the information. A lot of it's already covered, but uh, just wanted to validate that the uh wish strips and purunga are coming back so that's probably the the biggest things out of out of the v jump leak all right as always thanks for watching i'll catch you guys later